why leaders need to lead with we instead of I. I believe that being a great leader is very challenging. Not only do you have to be focused on your own performance, but also the performance of others. Leaders can't have a bad day, even a bad moment, as this sends the wrong message to the team and morale can quickly drop. You have to be consistent as a leader, as well as inspiring, visionary, quick thinking and many other key skills as well. Leadership is about getting the team on board and wanting to follow you into battle. It's about getting everyone moving in the same direction, everyone feeling part of the team and sharing the credit with your team for their success. Too many times I hear leaders saying I statements when things are going well and not so much when things aren't. It was with real interest I read a blog recently from marketing guru Seth Godin who said simply switching from I to we is one of the most profound ways a business leader can improve the way their company interacts with its customers and partners. He went on to say, instead of saying I when you're ready to take credit, try we, and instead of saying we when you're avoiding responsibility, try I. Interesting how a simple change of a pronoun can have a massive impact. This is certainly backed up by researcher Jim Collins in his exceptional book, Good to Great. He found that the difference between top performing and low performing CEOs was their use of the same words, I and we. The lower performing CEOs use I many more times than the word we, and the reverse was found with the top performing leaders. Collins also used the term the window in the mirror to identify another massive difference between top and lower performing CEOs. His research found that poorer performing CEOs looked out the window to criticize and looked in the mirror to praise while the top performing CEOs did the opposite. Who would have thought that words make a difference, particularly these small ones? If you're a leader or an inspiring one, I would recommend checking your language next time you're talking with your team. Are you an I leader who looks out the window to criticize or are you on the right track with your use of we?